everyone, I'm Amanda from Mandolin Plants. Welcome back for another video. This is always one of my most favorite videos I get to film every year, and it is my Hobonichi order unboxing, and this year it is bigger than ever. I have never received a massive brown box from Hobonichi before, so I'm super excited to get into this with you. I did just have some damage on the top of the box, but I think everything inside is okay. And I have my camera way zoomed out more than normal, and you still can't even see it all. But here is the brown paper. And then you can kind of see everything. The pink box is hidden inside here underneath these freebies. Looks like I got two pink boxes. And then two gray boxes. And of course the freebies for ordering exclusively from the Hobonichi store. I really like that they came in bubble wrap this year. I have never seen things um, bubble wrapped like this before, so I'm really excited about that. So in this bubble wrapped bag, I got the freebie spoons. I have three of each design. I think I saw that there were three designs total and I got two of them. So just the little spoon and then the deal that goes on the spoon so you can put it on your purse or your planner if it has a zip pull or something like that. And then I always get a couple of these small memo books also. They are just grid paper on the inside. They're really thin and they fit in the back pocket of your cover or inside, um, it's just the A5 size. They also have A6 and weak sizes as well. So like I mentioned before, I did get two of these and one is my five year cover. So I'm gonna open that one first. I've actually never had a five year planner and so I'm really excited that I got that this year. This is the search and collect cover. It was a cover that was available starting last year and I really liked it from what I saw in the pictures and everything. It's just a button and it has um, an adjustable size and then a little piece of stuff in there. And it is just so pretty, this tri-fold here and then a spot for a pen, which it looks like it's nice and big and can fit any fountain pen that I choose to write um, with my five year in. So I'm really excited about this cover. And then I have my cousin cover that I'm really excited about. I got the navy tambourine. I love these cute little bookmarks. I love how the ends are always different with these covers. And you have some cards in here inside the pockets. And you get these. There's a pocket here, pocket here, pocket here, pocket here. And then I liked this year that this one was not a zip cover. I've had a Mina zip cover before and I liked it for a while. It wasn't my favorite to carry. I prefer the ones with the pin loops that you can just open and not have to zip. So I was really, really excited that the Navy Tambourine this year was in the classic pen style and not the zippy. So you can probably see some of the texture there. I love how pretty this tambourine cover is. All right, now we're on to one of the two pink boxes. It does look like there was some damage here, but I have seen some boxes come really, really damaged, so I am thankful that it was in the nice big brown protective box to keep all of my goodies safe. I'm sure you have seen the inside of this so far if you've watched lots of unboxings, and this is actually the reason that my unboxing took so long, because this um, Liberty Fabrics cover said that it wouldn't ship until the end of September, so I'm so excited that it's here. And I will be taking everything out of the plastic, but just to quickly flip through and show you all the goodies I got, I got a 2022 original, 2022 English planner, the stencil because mine is broken, the A6 weekly calendar supplement. This is my weeks that I got. I got the Dreamscape and it is so pretty. I can't wait to take that out of the package. And then of course my Hobonichi cousin Avec. And a full year cousin also. And then in pink box number two, Oh, this looks like my husband's cover that he picked. This is the one with the black on the outside and the clear blue on the inside. And then a day free, the A5 size. Another Hobonichi cousin of Vec. This one is for my husband. And then, there it is, my five year and then all of the pens. All of the planners come with pens. 
Um, the Weeks do not come with the spoons. I think that might be the only one that doesn't. I have seven pens and six spoons, so I think I'm right. The Weeks only gets the pen. I love the color of the pen this year. So I am gonna start with my five year. I wanted to get one of these last year, but by the time I decided they were already sold out and they weren't restocking and I totally understand why. It's a little booklet. These are always fun to kind of flip through, but then I don't keep them. This is, it looks like a test sheet so you can kind of test out your spreads. That's a cute idea. I don't think I've ever seen something like that before. And here it is, the five year. I've never had one of these before. The cover is really fun and different. But then of course, it's just the same Hovenichi paper that we know and love. Oh, I'm so excited. And then you do get all of the five year at a glance spreads at the beginning. So this is fun. Ooh, I'm really excited. So you have in this case, it starts with 2022 and goes all the way to 2026. And this is the January one page. And then you have a full blank page where you could doodle or put pictures in. I'm not quite sure how I'm gonna use this yet. I might rotate and have like this one be 2022 and then have this one be 2023, just to give some space and some room to write some more explanations. I'm thinking of using this for like a child memory planner, things that I want to remember um, that happened in our family. And so that's what I am going to do with this. And it's such a small space, even if I just write one sentence quickly before I go to bed, um, just to have this. So I'm really excited about this. I know our girls will just grow lots and lots in the next five years. Our oldest is going to be four next month. So I know how fast the time goes. I just wanted to quickly slip this in. Oh, it slips in like a dream. Oh, I am just really, really excited about this. Okay, so right now, this is the snap that I'll use, and there's plenty of wiggle room in there for a pen, so the pen could be really chunky and still fit fine, so I am really excited about that. And like I said, this cover and a back are for my husband, so I'm going to leave them in the plastic and let him have the joy of unbagging it himself. But I'm really excited that he wanted to try a cousin this year. He's never tried a cousin, he's tried a week's. He's in a Wonderland 222 right now, and he thought the extra space in the cousin with having a daily page every single day would be good for him. Now that he's working full time with me at MLP, so I'm really excited about that. I'm really excited, can you tell? <laughs> okay, so this is my day free. And this is a little booklet that comes with all of the planners. I will open it up this time, but then the rest I won't. So here is just a cute little, it changes every year. It's kind of fun to flip through. I'm sure you've seen this a million times if you've been watching all the unboxings. I personally like to use my Hobonichi Day Free as a work planner. Um, some planning happens in it, but actually mostly it is used to track when sales are. So I use our transparent dots to mark sales and anything I need to remember for that. And then in these pages, I actually track some things. So I track how many orders we had. I tracked the revenue each day. And it's really fun to flip back through previous years and see how certain days compare. So that's what I use this one for. And then in the monthly section, I'm able to plan out when sales are and new releases. And then in these pages, I use them just as a blank notebook. I might write the scripts that I have for that day or anything of that nature. So I love my day freeze every year and I actually get them spiral bound. I take them to Home Depot and have them slice off the end and then spiral bind them so that I can flip it back on itself and have it on my desk. Next up is the Full Year Hobonichi Cousin, and this one I use to take example pictures. I do make sticker kits, and so I always need a planner to make example pictures in, and so it's always nice having one of these. I am not aware of any changes that they made. I think the spreads are exactly the same as the last year, um, so if you want a more in-depth flip-through video, you can look at a previous video of mine. This is my personal favorite. I love the Hobonichi Cousin of Vec. I love that it's split into two books. It's much less to carry, especially because mine get really bulked up from my sticker usage. It is the exact same as the whole year cousin, except it is split into six months, so you're only carrying around January to June or July to December. But I am going to try this out in my new navy tambourine cover. 
This cover is designed for the whole year. So if you just put one side of the Avec in, it's gonna feel pretty thin. So I wouldn't recommend just carrying this one. You could use either um, another notebook in here or you could put both books in and then it fills it out much better. I'm really excited about that. Can you tell I'm just, I said that already. I'm just, I'm really excited. I love Hobonichi Day. It's like Christmas all over again. The weeks that I picked, as I said before, is the Dreamscape and it is as beautiful in person as I was hoping it would be. Oh, it is so pretty. You might be wondering why I get so many planners and that is because we, like I said, we do make stickers for them. This is really pretty. It matches the, the outside here. So I need, I need all of the planners so that I can take example pictures and in case the spreads do change, which usually they don't. Um, but just to stay up on the sizing and everything, we always have to get all of the planners. So yes, this is a very large Hobonichi haul. <laughs> and yes, we do use them all. So I'm just peeling off this white part here so I can put this pocket in the back eye. If I don't do it now, it just kind of floats around and it annoys me so I'm just gonna put it right there so that it's in and I don't have to worry about it anymore I love the edges in this one of the reasons I got this one is because of the edges because when I take example pictures ooh, and this looks nice and black oh good so when I take example pictures you'll be able to see the edges and I'm really excited yay and it does have the 2022 up in the corner I can see it I'm trying to get it to show you on camera mm. Okay, it really is there, I promise. Okay, can you see it now? <laughs> okay, next we have the Hobonichi Techo Original, and this is just like the cousin, except it is smaller. It is an A6 instead of an A5. The spreads basically look exactly the same. They're just shrunken. An A6 is half of an A5, if you are unfamiliar with paper sizes. So this is a cute little book. And then the English planner is very similar. It's the same size, but the spreads are different. It has more English. The quotes at the bottom are in English. And then the monthly spreads are just a tad different also. So here is how those look. There are some color differences. And the biggest difference is the grid space. This is a four grid and the Hobonichi Techo cousin and original are 3.7. So just a little bit smaller. And then we have this beautiful cover. I just love this one. You may know I'm a sucker for anything floral. So very exciting Liberty fabrics. And I'm going to put the original in here. The English would work also, but usually I use the original for my example pictures. I do occasionally take example pictures in the English one, but this is the one that we use more. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, I love it. I was tempted to get a cover on cover for it, and I know they say that they recommend not using a cover on cover because it's thicker and it might not work and it might damage, but it's fabric, and so I, I just want it to stay looking nice. So I might try and put a cover on cover on it anyway. We'll see. And then the last book I have to show you is this cute little A6 weekly calendar supplement. I have tons of questions about this all the time. It is not an official full size planner. So it's in the accessories section on the website and it is only weekly spreads. The reason they have this is because in the original and the English planner, there are no weeklies. The cousin has weeklies, but the A6 only has dailies and monthlies and so they made this little a6 calendar supplement and it's smaller you can tell than the actual a6 and it fits in this back pocket so if you have the need to have weeklies they designed this small enough to fit so that you can just grab it when you need to see your full week personally i have to see my full week in an hour by hour breakdown that's why i love my cousin um, but if you like the a6 size there is a weekly also and we do make sticker kits for this cute little book as well and the only other accessory that I got this year was the green stencil. I use this thing all the time, usually to rip washi, <laughs> but I do use it for lots of other things. Mine has broken right here. Um, I think, I think my daughter was playing with it, honestly, and it just like these little dash marks broke. And so it annoys me that it bends. So I got a new one and they're not very expensive, so she can just have the other green one. She will love that. But this does make a really handy washi card if you need one. 
and it fits great in these Hobonichi pockets also. I say that and now I can't get it in. They really do. <laughs> okay, there we go. So that is my 2022 Hobonichi haul. I would love to know what you got down in the comments. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Until next time.